We found a baby magpie that had blown out of a tree after a storm. And by Friday, he had taken over our lives. Are you hungry? Do you want to be fed? His parents are still flying around. We couldn't get him back into the nest, and neither could they, so we needed to take over feeding duties. I love you too, Nigel. I love you too. And snuggling and affection duties too. Baby birds cannot feed themselves. We use a mixture of kangaroo meat and pharynx. The food has to be placed in their throat so they can swallow. Magpies are social and inquisitive and do not want to be by themselves. Either you want to be fed or you don't. Do you want to be fed? They try really hard to communicate and interact with you. Magpies will pester you and mimic you and become really good talkers. They will also mirror your mood. If you're happy, they're happy. If you get cranky, they get cranky. The more you feed them in one meal, the longer it is before they ask you for another. Nigel is several weeks old. Therefore, he only needs to be fed four or five times a day. Here comes the airplane. No more. No more. Airplane. They are very intelligent birds and they love to play. So be playful with them. Big juicy bug. Ooh, big juicy bug. Nope. Sit down. He's had enough. Magpies are very intelligent birds and very affectionate. They can form very strong bonds, not only with their own flock, but also with other creatures, including humans. And they love shiny things. What would you do if I took my glasses off? No, they're good things. Helps me see you. Helps me see you. If you're fostering a baby magpie, remember to talk to it and sing to it so that it will find its own you voice. Sing song? Nigel, no mate, a silly young crow. Nigel, no mate, said nowhere to go. Nigel, no mates fell out of his tree. Now Nigel, no mates is here with you and me. Here it is. Here it is. Alright, just calm down. Stay calm. Baby birds can get ill if they're exposed to loud noises or a stressful environment. So make sure the way you keep them is calm and calm them down if they get stressed. Remember, birds snuggle, pat, and groom each other. Just want to play? Yes, yes, just play. Play, please. Please let me play. Eventually, Nigel will be feeding for himself and flying for himself, and he'll fly out our door one day and rejoin his flock where he will be able to raise his own family but I'm sure he'll come back to visit his foster parents. Can I settle that? Okay. Good boy. Can I get back on with my work now?